He makes it as far as a train station but then his wound for before opens and he needs Dr. Benson's help. Dr. Benson is at home with Jacob when she gets the call from the train station from Klaatu, asking for her help and she rushes over there with Jacob in the back seat. After leaving the train station they are trailed by the authorities throughout New York, New Jersey, and the forested highlands. The presence of the spaceship has caused a worldwide panic. The United States military tries to attack Sphere-like spaceship and robot whose name is Gort but shockingly the robot actives and destroyed the unmanned aerial vehicles that launch Hellfire missiles. At a restaurant Claude meets with a Mr. Wu. We learn that he is another alien who has been leaving an Earth for 70 years and has been assigned by the same group of alien civilization. Upon learning from him of humanity's destructive tendencies, Claude determined that humans shall be exterminated to ensure that the planet Earth with its rare ability to assist complex life can survive. Mr. Wu decides to stay on Earth, having seen another side to humanity that he loves. Claude can't see this love so he orders smaller spheres like spaceship previously hidden on Earth to begin taking animal species off the planet. This is compared to Noah and his Ark and the flood that destroys the world. Meanwhile the robot, is subjected to experiments in an underground facility in Virginia. It then transforms itself into a swarm of insect-like nanites that begin destroying human or other things in their path back to Manhattan including an armored battalion of the U.S. Army. Dr. Benson tries to convince Claude that the world is not bad and that humans can change the Earth for the better, but Claude was still unconvinced. She then takes him to the home of Nobel Prize-winning Professor Barnhart, where they discuss how Claude's own species that went through a drastic evolution to survive its own star destruction. Claude is convinced by Helen and Jacob that humans can change their ways and are worth saving. However instead of quietly sleeping in the next room, Jacob calls 800 hotline and reports where Claude is. He quickly learns his mistake when Dr. Benson is captured by military personnel and he is left alone with Claude. The two of them keep